Hey, you gay Tim. Hope you guys are doing well. Uh, this is Charles. Um, like we'd spoken before, um, Wally did digital. Um, I help uh, businesses grow. And I thought you guys this uh, short video showing you what I do and um, hopefully how I can help you guys grow um, in terms of your visibility online. So I wanted to share uh, a few tips, basically three main things um, that usually I tell, I tell people these things can help you grow um, in rankings on Google. And those three things are backlinks, citations, and content. Content, citations, and backlinks. Uh, to start off with content is everything that's on your page. Everything I've highlighted here include all the text, all the text behind the pictures, um, what the pictures are saved as. For, for example, if I was to save one of these pictures, I can see it's you see it's saved as uh, ran, random random uh, letters and numbers, string of letters and numbers. Uh, Google picks up on all of that, so it's good to save it as a uh, certain keyword that you know potential customer or client may be um, searching for you for. Uh, for example, this one here, you see it's the same thing. So um, Google optimizes for about 1,000 to 1,500 words of text on your front page, showing you know authoritative text, showing like what you do, who you are, um, et cetera, your services, locations, etc. Um, so I would definitely add a lot more text to your front page, um, even the other pages. And also, it's it's important to to um, saturate it with keywords. And by keywords, I mean, for example, if someone is looking for CBD farms, that's the keyword that they would type into Google. So um, saturate the whatever text you're putting here in actually in every page, saturate it with keywords. And that's where uh, some good keyword research comes in. You got to know what your clients or potential customers are looking for. Um, so that's it for content. Second thing I want to talk about is citations. And citations comes when someone searches for a keyword in Google. So usually you'd see some ads here. But as you can tell, um, I don't think anyone in your business really does Google ads. I don't Oh, Here we go. Here's an ad down here. Um, reason I'm saying that is because I don't know, I'm not sure about Google's policy and CBD. Um, anyway, that's a, something else to talk about. However, um, so you, first you'd see ads, and then you'd see what's known as this map pack, where you have a map and then three businesses. Now, the way to rank up here is through citations. Citations are is citations are wherever your business, your name, address, and phone number exactly as they are on Google, um, appear in different directories online. So, for example, um, Yext, Dextnos, Superpages.com, Yellowpages.com, uh, Whitepages.com, LinkedIn, Yelp, etc. The more authoritative directories you're in, the higher and higher you will rank here. There are tools out there that you can find out how many, just how many citations all your competitors have. And uh, the goal is to like double or triple them. The tool I use is uh, called Whitespark. And I'm just going to take a second competitor. I had already put him in. Uh, Blackbird Creek Farms. Um, they have seven citations. So that'd be pretty easy to beat to go and probably double or triple the number of citations. So, you know, get about uh, 20, 25 or so different citations. Um, and then you'd start to rank higher and eventually beat this guy um, in the map pack. So you'd be seen here for the search for CBD farms. Um, that's citations. The backlinks have to do with the next part of the search results, um, which is like the organic, organic search listings. Um, so I'm going to take this guy, Rolling Acre Farm, or Hey Good Farms, as uh, as an example. But anyway, backlinks are are when other web pages link to your web page. So for example, if there's a CBD forum um, in in New Jersey and they have a blog site and they happen to mention you guys in the great how you know they like working with you and put your link there. Google sees that as an authoritative backlink. You know, not all backlinks are the same because if um, Pizza Hut is linking to you guys, uh, Google s sees that oh that's a different niche, 
uh, seems a bit spammy and will not count it as much as good. So it wouldn't be as relevant. Um, there are tools out there to analyze different websites. And I'm, like I said, I'm going to take this guy. Um, I use a tool called Arefs. It's a popular tool. And here we go. Oh, this is Rolling Acre Farm, the first one here. Okay. So I put them in and I can see all the backlinks that they have coming from 19 domains. And it's pretty easy just to go in here and see where they have backlinks. Make sure um, if they're valuable enough, uh, make sure you go in there and make sure you guys have backlinks there. Match your competition. Not only that, double or triple them the number of backlinks so that you, you uh, start to beat them in this, in this um, organic listing section. I want to take Hey Good Farms as another example. So I put them into the tool. And you can see they have, it's a bit of a stronger website. They have about uh, 161 backlinks and they're ranking for all these words. So this is a good example for your competition to go in, look at their keywords that they're ranking for. Um, here, farm CBD or CBD farm, about a thousand people search per month. And the traffic they get is 23 people. So that's Quite a, quite a bit because they're in the eighth position. Uh, CBD Farms, they're in the third position that we saw. 400 people look for that one month and they get 41 people going to their site. So the, the name of the game is to look at your competition, look at their keywords, make sure you rank for those that are relevant for you, make sure you include those that are relevant to you guys in on your website and all your content. And then um, work on your backlinks as well. Uh, now these guys have quite a bit, but this is possible to beat. Um, I can see the quality of the backlinks. A lot of them are from zero to ten, from a zero to a hundred scale. So it'd be your job to like or whoever's doing your SEO to go out and find relevant backlinks, add them, and slowly but surely you will start to rank higher than uh, your competition. Uh, this might take a few months. But uh, you definitely you are able to um, you'll be able to beat these guys and and your other competition. So those are three things I wanted to talk about: um, content citations and backlinks. Um, if you like this and if you'd like to talk about partnering together, I'd love to do that. Um, otherwise, just give this to who, whoever's doing your um, website and your uh, SEO stuff. And um, yeah, these tips will help you guys start ranking. All right, take it easy. All the best.